cos of 2 tan inverse of 1 upon 7 minus sin of 4 tan inverse of 1 upon 3. Since we know that 2 tan inverse x is equal to tan inverse of 2x upon 1 minus x square for x lies between minus 1 and plus 1. So here 1 upon 7 lies between minus 1 to plus 7 which is less than 1. So we can write here cos of tan inverse of 2 into 1 by 7 divided by 1 minus 1 upon 7 whole square that is 1 upon 49. So this can be written cos of tan inverse of so the numerator 14 by 14 and we can write and denominator 14 minus 148 so which equals to cos of tan inverse 7 upon 24. Now we need to convert tan inverse 7 upon 24 into cos. So let's consider right angle triangle. Since it's given say, tan inverse of 7 by 24 that is opposite by adjacent for an angle. Opposite by adjacent is given 7 by 24. So that we can find the hypotenuse 7, 24 and 25 are Pythagorean triplets. So we can write 25 and hence for cos we will take adjacent by hypotenuse which is equal to cos of cos inverse of 24 by 25 cos of cos inverse theta so which can be taken here and it lies between minus 1 to plus 1 so cos of cos inverse theta is equal to 24 upon 25 make this as 1 and let's consider the second part sine of 4 tan inverse 1 upon 3 sine of 4 tan inverse 1 upon 3 which is equal to sine of 2 times of we can write 2 tan inverse 1 upon 3 which equals to sine of 2 times of tan inverse of 2 by 3 same formula 2x upon 1 minus x square so 1 minus by 9 so which equals to sine of 2 times of tan inverse and here multiplying and divide with 3 to get 9 as the LCM denominator. So we will get 6 upon 9 divided by 9 minus 1 that is 8. So which is equal to sine of 2 times tan inverse of it comes to 3 by 4. And again applying the formula sine of uh, 2 tan inverse formula sine of tan inverse of 2 into 3 by 4 that is 6 upon 4 divided by 1 minus 3 upon 4 whole square is 9 by 16 so which equals to sine of tan inverse of and in the denominator 16 so let's multiply and divide with 4 6 4 is 24 upon 16 and 16 gets cancelled in the denominator after simplifying so 16 minus 9 it comes to 7 so tan inverse of 24 upon 7 so let's convert this tan inverse to sin inverse so tan inverse opposite by adjacent that is 24 here and 7 for an angle and so we know that 24 7 and 25 are Pythagorean triplet so 25 here so we can write sin is opposite by adjacent opposite by hypotenuse that is 24 upon 25 so we can write this is sin of sin inverse of 24 upon 25 since 24 upon 25 is less than 1 so sin of sin inverse x is equal to 24 upon 25 so let's mark this as second one so from 1 and 2 from 1 and 2 the given sum cos inverse we can add 24 upon 25 minus of 24 upon 25 first one minus second one so which equals to 0 so we can give our answer option b